it's almost difficult to find the words to describe this. The last time I was here for a tour, there was still scaffolding in the hall, and they were just beginning to lay this Italian marble. It, it just takes your breath away. It is gorgeous, and the sound is spectacular. There were several photographers right a couple of rows up from us. You could hear every movement they made. It is unbelievable. It, it just surpasses all of the really terrific expectations I had. It's over the top. Oh, it was awesome. I, I am so happy to have been able to be here for this opening night. It's, it's just really impressive. The building is gorgeous. The music was wonderful. And I know it's going to be really successful venue. Oh, I think it certainly puts us on the map nationally, if not internationally, as far as concert halls are concerned. It's just got to, it's got to bring in some huge talent all across the world. It's going to be exciting. My impression is the acoustics are beautiful and they're going to continue to work on it. I just can't imagine what it's going to sound like once they start open up the season in, Jan in January. The Palladium will bring so much talent to this town and people won't have to travel far to, to find it. They can come right here in their own hometown. It's a wonderful thing. Well, this is absolutely a thrilling night. We've watched this Palladium being built through the, back to the last months, and I walked in to the orchestra area and absolutely had to catch my breath. Absolutely phenomenal, beautiful. Oh, it's incredible. I, this is my first time in this building, and we're incredibly impressed with the performers and the sound. This did not come across as a rehearsal at all. It came across as a final performance. We're all thrilled to be here and looking forward to the season ahead. The building's beautiful. I, I love the mayor's performance. What, what courage to stand out on that stage with his French horn in front of all of us. And that, um, that pianist and, and the harpist were just fantastic. Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing that pianist again when the Carmel Symphony Orchestra has its premier performance right here in this hall. I think that this building is important to the entire community just because it's something that brings us all together and we can all experience something at one time. Whereas there are, the Old Town is for certain kinds of people and the Monon is for certain kinds of people and not everybody can utilize those, whereas this everybody can utilize. Children, my age, youth, adults, older adults as well, and it's just something that can bring us all together and you know give us a central part of Carmel that we can all enjoy. What did I enjoy most about the concert this evening? Uh, experiencing different ranges of music. So we had the mayor playing sort of some classical music and then Michael singing the Great American Songbook, but then we had Dee Wu with her incredible incredible range on the piano. Uh, it, it was just an extraordinary, extraordinary evening. I was uh, just captivated by everything. And it was the true range of music that did it for me. Knowing, of course, that three months from now, what we heard today will sound different. It was a very heady experience performing uh, in this hall. I know it was for the purpose of sound, judging the sound. And yet it was something that um, artistically was very fulfilling. I, didn't know what to expect. I knew that it would be good. Something special happens, though, with every space in which any music is made. And songs that I've performed many times before felt very different and alive and very full and rich in this space. As I look back on, on this day, I, I think I remember the excitement on all the people that came here tonight. They were upbeat. They were excited. They were thrilled to see what's inside this building. And, and then I just heard gasps of amazement when they saw how beautiful it was inside. And that was a very gratifying feeling, and that's what I remember.